Okay. Hello, Leo. I have done your reading. Unfortunately, every aspect of it was had no voice, no sound. I do apologize because my phone adapter holder on the side turned down my volume. So I'm going to explain your reading. I'm not going to overdo it. I'm not going to do it over because it was absolutely amazing. And I'm, I, I literally love the energy on these cards for you. So Leo, I'm going to explain how these cards resonate with you. And if, that, if the energy that I'm going to explain to you does resonate with you, please comment below and let me know that you actually got to listen to this. <laughs> and that you like the content it does resonate with you and i will be doing other videos but right now as of tonight i am not in my usual studio so i don't have the same setup um, i did sage and poly santos and energized and cleared your energy and i did meditate on all your cards before i started the reading <clears throat> so with that said how this reading has started was when I was shuffling your cards, the card that came out was life purpose. Okay. Life purpose is the purpose of your life is to serve in a way that brings great joy to yourself and others. Don't worry about finding your purpose. Instead, purpose upon serving a focus upon serving a purpose and then your purpose will serve you now this card was phenomenally intense with the cards that that came out tonight all right so um first the first card that came out was the six of wands and the six of wands upside down this is actually celebration that you were that you got over the hump but see you actually have not yet gotten over the hump current energy now okay is because of the fact that you have an ex that is trying to charm you male or female however it goes okay and you are reading behind the bs and you are like you know what no i'm good thanks but i'm i'm not going backwards in life because i have a life purpose mm-hmm all right, so that's how those cards came out. And then in your present energy, or your present, because that was like the past, which is the actual energy you were starting this thought process about doing something different in life. So this right here, these were clarification that yes, you do realize that you want to do something different. So the other card that came out, the next card that came out was the Seven of Pentacles. The Seven of Pentacles is seeing something grow now i started to think that this was a business and possibly um, like a move somewhere but as i went along spirit had told me that no it's not you're hanging around because you've got somebody in mind that you feel you would like to have and share your life purpose with okay the next card that came out was the Queen of Cups, which is actually the emotions. And what that I entailed with that was you are hanging out to see if this person feels, feels the same way that you do about seeing a relationship grow. Okay. And so the Spirit clarified that you are getting positive information and, and confirmation that yes this is the one that you do want to e either go into business with or have a relationship with that's that's how you'll know it resonates and you will feel like you will have the world you'll be on top of the world and that's all positive energy okay then the next card that i drew was imagine and the Imagine card from the, um, the Soul's uh, Journey, um, 
card. Why did I just get another message from Spirit? I don't know. I don't want to interrupt it. But anyways, um, this is where the Queen of Cups came in. You're imagining the emotions and all the good times you're going to have with this person and all the things you want to do and the family you might want to build. Okay. And then the next card that came up was Loyal Heart. And these are um, the Wisdom Oracle cards, by the way. I do correct myself. Uh, loyal Heart. And that actually has to do with the growth of the relationship. And the Tribe, which is the actual person that you do feel you want to be in either partnership or relationship with. You really do feel confident that um, you are glad you stuck around. And the other two cards that were clarified were milk and honey, which means that you really do feel like this is the sweet in the pot. You, you feel like they're going to enrich your life and you are going to enrich theirs. And the uh, exchanging gifts, that's the either love or money, you know, as far as like helping each other out. So this is a really good reading, Leo. I am really, really glad that um, Spirit has given me these messages. And they also gave me a male figure. This is male energy, which is why I put it, why Spirit actually put it with the Seven of Pentacles to actually see it grow. So it might be with a man or a man, it's it, like I said, it's up to you. Um, it's, it's your reading. So you'll know how this resonates. And um, the last card out of this deck was New Life, which is actual clarification of all this new life you're going to make new life and you're going to make it grow absolutely so happy for you so the other two cards that came out actually three all right was the parrot this one came out first the parrot someone will gossip all about your secrets and you know who that is that is the ex or ex-partner, whatever it is in your life, um, that is going to try to undo what you're doing with your happiness because they tried to charm you and you walked away. So they're pissed off. So they're going to try to spread rumors. So you need to keep that courage that you have and be proud that you are. Absolutely. So... That was your reading, and I really do, I tried to recap it, so I'm going to have to put, um, I'm, I'm, I'm going to try to put the part of the layout of the cards, whether it has the volume or not, I really haven't decided that, but if you are happy with how I did this for you so you can hear what was laid, um, let me know in the comments, and um, yes, I am so happy for you. I look forward to hearing any good vibes and anything that's going to happen with you within this progress and this progress forward. And like I said, do not let yourself get wrapped up with any emotions from the ex. You make sure you keep that pride and your shoulders back and you show that courage that you don't need them anymore and you fill your life purpose. All right, Leo, thank you so much for your time. I appreciate it. I hope you really enjoyed this. And if you did, please like, click the like button. And um, yes, definitely subscribe so you can, I'm going to try to do this twice a week for you. So definitely looking forward to it. I am really glad that I did this for you. So you guys have a great night. And until next time, love and light.